We told you about an Ohio man who posted a dramatic video confession online. He admitted to killing a 61-year-old he'd never met. Well, today prosecutors are expected to file charges, and the man says he will turn himself in. Don Daler is here. Don, good morning. Good morning, Nora. In the three-and-a-half-minute video posted online, he admits he was driving and drinking, trying to have a good time when he lost control. Black the man's face and voice are concealed as he begins the chilling confession. I ended up going the wrong way down the highway, directly into oncoming traffic, and I struck a car. I killed a man. Then he reveals his identity. My name is Matthew Cordell. And on June 22nd, 2013, I hit and killed Vincent Canzani. This video will act as my confession. Cordell was already a prime suspect, but says a lawyer told him he could beat the charges if and when they came. Maybe I would get a reduced sentence and maybe I would get off. But I won't dishonor Vincent's memory by lying about what happened. Boy, I've never seen one like this before, I would tell you that. Franklin County Prosecutor Ron O'Brien said the video confession was highly unusual. And Cordell's own lawyer was surprised. He confessed to a crime that he hadn't even been indicted on. So this was just a completely unique situation, nothing that I'd ever seen before. Steve Crane was a friend of the 61-year-old victim, Vincent Canzani. This is the right thing to do, and I think that's the way Vince would look at it. He, and in fact, I think Vince would be proud of, of that young man. Of course, Vincent Canzani can no longer speak for himself, but his daughter called the video self-serving saying, quote, my family has not been helped at all by this video. Nothing has changed for the better. And if anything, has only caused us heartache. I know Matt, and I know why he did this. And it wasn't to make himself look better. It was to raise awareness about drunk driving and to um, apologize. Cordell says he will plead guilty and faces between two and eight years in prison. I beg you, and I say the word beg, Specifically, I'm begging you, please don't drink and drive. The victim's daughter says the timing was bad and that if Cordell wanted to raise awareness about drunk driving, he should have waited longer. Now, for procedural reasons, the 22-year-old will initially plead not guilty to vehicular homicide and then change it to a guilty plea. Whether he gets two years or the maximum eight, his lawyer says that under Ohio law, Cordell will not be eligible for early release. Jeff Nora. Don Daler, thank you very much.